Hey guys, for this video, we'll show you how to install the CWM or TWRP recovery on your device on any Android device out there. So the only condition is you have a Rudy device, and then this will work for you. So first of all, all you need to do is go to Play Store and download this free app called as Raw Manager. Uh, there's actually two versions of this. Uh, one is uh, Raw Manager. Uh, premium and one is premium. Now the premium one will give you some uh, you know cool premium options uh, while the free one will give you you know the installation and download process of this uh, two recoveries over here so uh, first when you open up the app you have a bunch of options here uh, because you can use these options down uh, here only if you have installed a recovery here so first all you do is press here recovery setup and then you have to select which recovery you want to install, TWRP or CWM recovery or if you have already installed CWM recovery you can update it. Now I already installed the CWM recovery so I will select this it will confirm my phone model as you can see Google Nexus 5 and when I click on it I have some options you can enable this option so that you can get the touch, uh, touch feature on the recovery uh, or if you don't want to touch, uh, if you don't want to have touch feature on the recovery, you can have this flash clock, uh, clock or more recovery option here. You just have to click it, and it will start downloading. And once it starts downloading, uh, it, it, you do, your device will automatically you know, install this recovery without any problem. And then to check it, you just have to uh, reboot into the recovery mode. Click OK and your device should reboot into the recovery okay so if it's not recovering uh, if it's not rebooting into recovery mode just go to the recovery mode manually uh, by you know holding down the keys whatever device you have uh, but uh, it will work for you it's the most easiest way to install CWM or TWRP recovery on your Android device, the latest version, so I've installed it on my Nexus 5 and also I've installed it on my S2 and you know install a lot of ROMs, if you are my subscriber then you probably know about it 